The next term that we're going to define now that we've defined the term race is the term ethnicity. The term ethnicity is a little bit different from the term race because there's, there hasn't been any real attempt to make ethnicity scientific. So there's a whole social and psychological aspect to the term ethnicity. So one way to, to define the term ethnicity is to consider it to be um, someone's allegiance to a particular group of people with whom he or she has some kind of historical connection. So it's very much an emotional or psychological allegiance to a group of people. And someone's ethnicity can actually change over time. So um, a person could consider himself or herself to have one ethnicity at this point in time and another ethnicity at a different point in time. So it's a little bit more fluid and obviously there, there's not been this attempt to tie the definition or the term ethnicity to science. We can take the definition of ethnicity a bit further by dividing it into its objective components and its subjective components. So if we're looking at the objective components of ethnicity, this might be um, someone's physical features, so what they look like, eye color, skin color, eye shape, hair color, and so on. And then it might also be the geographical location someone is located in, and so on. So these are very objective pieces to the definition of ethnicity. And then on the other side, there's a subjective piece, which once again takes ethnicity away from the science um, that's, that people tried to attach to the term race. So the subjective side of ethnicity is uh, um, the idea that there are shared beliefs and shared values that go along with belonging to this specific group of people. And a final piece to this idea of ethnicity, the concept of ethnicity, is that it is somehow connected to the past. So ethnicity is a person's connection, both objective and subjective, to his or her past somehow. So through these objective characteristics and also through this subjective feeling of shared beliefs and values, an individual can connect himself or herself to the past by claiming to belong to a particular ethnic group. So there's this past to present connectivity that goes along with the idea of ethnicity as well.